Keon, welcome to the DigiMedia Pro's expo coverage here at SIGGRAPH 2016. And you're with Smith Micro. That is and, correct. And uh, you're the content genius of, of yeah. uh, Poser, right? That's your that official title, the content genius? Content genius is exactly my title. Yeah. <laughs> that is right. <laughs> All right. Um, so tell us a bit about Poser. What is Poser? Sure. Poser is our 2D figure posing and animation software. Um, you use it primarily for animating and or posing the characters that come with the software to create your illustrations and do some, do some things like animatics as well as um, illustrations. I see. So it's, you said it's 2D and 3D? You can render it's out? It's primarily 3D. You can render out 2D images from right. it. Right. Um, you can also import 2D images and movies into it to render out alongside your 3D objects. I see. So you would use this along with, let's say, After Effects? You can use it with After Effects. That is correct. Yes, okay. as well as other programs like 3D Studio Max, Maya, ZBrush, that sort of thing. So you would create your 3D model here and then bring it into like After Effects or Maya or? That is correct. You can totally do that. Um, you can also do the opposite, where you create in one of the other programs yeah. and bring it into Poser for animating purposes and then export the result out from there into After Effects. But yes, you can do that. I see, I see. And uh, what's the cost of this software? The cost at the moment is three forty nine, I believe, for the pro version. Okay. And the entry level version, I forget. That's the basic level. I believe it's around two hundred dollars, but it might be more or less. The prices though are available on our website. Yeah, they can check it out. Yeah. But so nobody's gonna hold you to it. Don't worry, you won't be fired. <laughs> uh, but what's the differences, if you could tell us, between sort of the entry level and the pro version? Sure. One of the major differences between the two are is the fact that the pro level has Gozi integration as well as um, a series of, of features like, excuse me, uh, the setup room for creating your characters. Um, it has uh, it has bullet physics built into it. It has the ability to use um, animated joint centers, uh, whereas in the standard version, you can use them, you can't create them. In the pro version, you can create and use them. Um, you also have a wider range of formats that it, ex that it exports out to, FBX being one of the more popular ones. I see. And people would use this mainly to create characters? Yes, that is the primary use for the program, characters. However, people have used it for other things as well. Um, besides just doing characters, they've done entire scenes in the program. Okay. Um, it's most popular right now uh, in programs like uh, Bones, the TV show, yeah. for doing crime scene uh, reconstruction, where they have entire scenes, not just the characters themselves. Oh, I see. That's interesting. Okay. Yeah. Cool. And then um, this runs on what? Windows, Mac? It runs on both Windows and Macintosh, yes. I see. Okay, cool. If people want to find out more about it, where they go? They can go to mysmithmicro.com, and that will lead them to the main pages for all of our graphics programs. Okay, great. Yeah. Well, Tian, really good to meet you. Thank you so much. Thank you for having me. It's been a pleasure.